we understand that this is the crucial time for every applicants who really want to come to China for their higher education. Hello everyone, welcome back. Hope you are doing great. Do you know that Chinese government scholarship type B provides more masters and PhD position than type A? From 2023, in type B, you can apply only on one university. Today, we are going to provide some information regarding CSC type B application. The reason is having prior knowledge increases your chances to obtain this scholarship and make your application process easier. So without further delay, let's get started. First of all, university agency number. You should keep in mind that all universities have different agency numbers. You can check the agency numbers of the universities on this website. We will provide the link in the description box below. You can also find the agency number required for your application on the chosen university's website. Before application, the crucial step is to get an acceptance letter from your supervisor which hold a significant role in your required document section. When applying for a master or PhD, it's essential to include a supervisor's acceptance letter. Otherwise, your application may be rejected. To obtain this letter, consider selecting universities and contacting professors in your preferred department via email. Watch this video to understand how to find professors. Next, you will need recommendation letters for your application, both from your professor or associate professor at your current or previous university. The application documents that you have to submit are the same for each university. We have made a video about the documents required to apply. However, every university has a different application deadlines. So you must check before application to your desired university. Many applicants ask whether they can apply if they have one semester remaining for their graduation. The answer is yes, you can apply with your pre-graduation certificate and available transcript from your current university. Next one is foreigner physical examination form. Remember, you must complete your medical test and fill up the form before your application. We understand that this is the crucial time for every applicant who really want to come to China for their higher education. And you might have some questions and doubts regarding this application. Till now, we got many comments and we try to answer them individually. And we believe you may have still some doubts on your mind and don't hesitate to leave a comment in our uh, channel and we will try in our next video to answer all these questions so that's all about today's video stay with us and take care mm -hmm.